A pioneering new treatment for blood cancer has been made available on the NHS for the first time. CAR-T therapy works by genetically modifying a patient's white blood cells so that their immune system can fight the cancer. Doctors at King's College Hospital, the first place to offer CAR-T therapy in England, say it can cure some terminally ill patients. Well, uh, let's talk now to Stephen Scowcroft, the Director of Operations at the charity Lymphoma Action. Uh, Stephen, great to have you with us. Just tell us a little bit more yeah. about uh, lymphoma, about this blood cancer, uh, the type of blood cancer that this treatment is working for in some patients. Yes, well, Lymphoma Action has been um, involved with the process of enabling ac further access to treatment around uh, CAR T cell for the last two years. It's a really exciting time for us and because it provides a hope uh, treatment. Patients that we've been talking to who've gone through this treatment, the side effects are, are, are pretty tough to begin with, but clearly in the long run, this makes a, a huge difference to them. It's also expensive, £280,000 per patient. Uh, what are your concerns about the NHS being able to to fund this going forward if there are increasing numbers of people who perhaps would benefit from this type of treatment? Again, this type of medicine uh, around personalised medicine and tailoring it to the individual is a, a key strategy kind of going forward. It's where a lot of uh, treatments are, are being developed. Um, it is expensive, <clears throat> but then also you need to weigh that up against what advantages that it brings as well. So instead of having many lines of chemotherapy, which also have lots of uh, difficult side effects that people need to go through, this is a one uh, type of treatment. And also then if, if as, as it shows, uh, it's early days, but as it shows at the moment, um, you don't need to then go back for more therapy. So there is savings of money as well. And our hope is that more of this treatment is available, that some of the savings that are made are put into CAR T cell and also other types of therapies that are being developed um, that will take this further, even, even more uh, 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 available for other lymphomas as well. So it's really exciting times. There are challenges with it. You know, the, the, uh, the, 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 the actual need for, for people to be in hospital for perhaps longer periods of time in, in this way, again, as opposed to traditional chemotherapy. But I think, again, what people are telling us, the people affected by lymphoma, is that this offers that hope where there, there certainly hasn't been uh, many options in the past. Okay, um, Stephen, very good to talk to you. Stephen Scowcroft from uh, Lymphoma Action. Thank you very much.